Okay, so I found this one. This picture, I, I believe it was on Amazon, and I'm like, okay, I wanna, I wanna make that. Um, and I'm probably not gonna make it exactly, but I like the idea of it, and so I'm gonna do it. And just need to do some art. I am marking off because I want a border on here. I'm using my blue tape. And I'm wondering if I can just, because I really. Let's see. I need smaller tape. I need my kitty. My kitty wants to go out. My kitty can wait. Here, I want the straight edge. Here. Line it up with the two edges. Because I don't want it to, I want it to be able to get up like that so I can move it around. Does anybody else think have a cat that thinks that they are a door opener? And Leo is flying around. Being Leo. Maybe I'll just not worry about it. <laughs> just do it. I see you. Okay, I guess I can just like that. I don't know how much that you can see, so I'll pull it up a little bit. There, like that. Okay, so I see little hearts. So what I thought I would do is I have a heart punch. What? What? And I'm wondering if I can take this piece of thing, let's just see something, and put it on a piece of vellum. This is probably not going to work, but we'll see. Oh. It did work. Then I could peel it off. Theoretically, I could peel it off. Like I said, maybe not. <clears throat> I need tweezers, maybe. No, this probably wasn't a great idea, huh? Well, I thought it would be a good idea. And it doesn't want to come off of there. No, that's really stuck on there, too. Yeah, that would take me forever. And ever and ever and ever. So maybe what I'll do instead of that is get some some different color cardstock. Or let me see. I have okay. I do. I have. Let's just try. A pink scrap, why not? And then, some we'll do. Let's 
put us there. Okay, and then I'm gonna get me. <laughs> In great Tina fashion, I'm gonna put some on glue stick. Right here. And one over here. And. I do have masking stuff somewhere, and that could work too, but I'm not sure where it is, so. so you know what masking stuff is, you can take that and paint it, and it will, um, just, hello Leo. Stop. Stop it. And then I think what I'm going to do is make here, make a little, make my B kind of round. Let's see. I think is what I'm going to do with the other thing. Actually, I could probably just, let me just do it this way. him and then cut this in half and do this this may not work but here and here that okay is there one I'm missing to think another one right there okay now done with that now I need a round thing let me just get um this one this looks like it would work but I actually want it to be more of an oval. Like that. And I'm going to put the glue stick here and do this. What? Okay. So now we can come in with all these brushes. We're gonna go light to dark. So the first thing is gonna be, I'll put this back up, is gonna be Wild Honey. And of course my brushes are all not cool. So we're gonna, yeah, Wild Honey. Here. Then we'll go down the whole thing. Okay, now we have some blue, which I think I'm going to do. I think it might look like the salty ocean. But, um, maybe this color. Put this up. And we're going to go a little bit over here. Of course, it's going to make it look all nice and green a 
a little dark right there. <laughs> okay. Like that. More over here. I want it to be. Like this. Then I'm going to get my grain. I can find it. Rustic Wilderness. Are you pooping on my chair? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Leo, what are you doing, Leo? And I'm going to do this here. Get it nice and dark. Like that. And then at the very bottom, I'm going to use, oops, all my people came out. Some of this um, um, scorched timber. Okay. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna put these guys up. Oh my god, mess. I swear, Leo, if you bite me, he's on my. F Hello. Mwah. You gonna be a good boy? You gonna be a good boy? I need a. I need a paper towel. And some water. I'm seeing a little bit of splotches. Okay. And then... Cause I like that kind of look. Okay, so like that. So now I'm going to take this. You can't really see a whole lot of it. My yellow isn't dark enough. I need to make it yellow darker. Actually, just can't really see it. So I think what I'm going to do is add a little bit of a little bit more wild honey. I definitely want those little parts to show. And that's the point of doing it if you can't see them. Right, right. Okay, much better. What's going on, Mr. Leo? Okay, now I can erase this. I'm going to get my alcohol markers, get some yellow, and some black. And I think I'm going to make sure that I have left little eyes. So I'm going to make my eyes. To be kind of big. 
Yeah, I got a little pink on there. It's okay. From the glue. So I can take this thing. If there's adhesive on there. This will take it off. Makes it look kind of kind of fuzzy. <laughs> and Dye's little face. I think waterproof markers would probably work better. I'm beginning to think alcohol markers are not like a lot of fun because they just, you know, Our little bee is kind of like so. <laughs> Ow, Leo. Ow. All right. So I think I need some watercolor actually. I think that I'm going to need, I know I'm going to need a Sharpie. So, well, this isn't a Sharpie actually, it's a Micron. And let me just do some of this here. I need to my face, no eyebrows. And little antenna. And some here. And his little feet. <laughs> He's kind of cute. <laughs> He's kind of cute. I'm going to make my what I need and he's not going to be very good. Much. I'm going to get me some of this and a paintbrush if I can find one. Oh, you know what would work really well is some graphite. So I might do that. take some graphite and go around the edges like that yeah that works really good so that's what I'm gonna do I'm gonna go right here and this is just a smoosher a little bee Give this a little shadow too. And then I'm gonna take this graphite and I'm gonna go like this. Leo, quit biting me. He wants he's not really biting me, he's like kind of biting my hair. He's like you good boy. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> I think maybe if I had 
a little bit of this here, maybe. The graphite really works right there. Oh, Nate. I had another piece, another kind. This isn't a very good pencil. I need a shh. Um, I mean, it works okay, but I need actually a... Let's see if I can get a brush. Let me use a brush. Let's see if I can get a little bit of this here. That looks better. That cute. Now I need to make the sign. So I can take this off. I need to make the sign now. So I'm going to take this off. Okay, and the sign I think it's gonna be. And I have another piece of thing here. And I think the sign should be, because looking at that one, it looks like it needs to be about two and a half by two and a half. We're gonna do that. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go ahead and draw. Um Hey, baby. Two, or should it be three? Let's do, if I did two and a half, it'd be right there. Definitely two and a half, definitely, definitely two and a half. Okay, so I'm gonna, what I'm gonna do is make um, a two, I need a two and a half inch box. So what I'm gonna do is do this, I'm gonna, Two and a half. It just doesn't look very big, does it? Let's do two and three quarters just to make it a little bit bigger. <laughs> two and... A little more, three quarters. I'm just using this as a template, like, actually. So, and two... Three quarters, three quarters, so, yeah, <laughs> Leo. Stop it. Oh, no, get down. <laughs> Honestly. Because... Almost looks like it'll be good. Almost looks like it's less going this way. So I think I'm gonna cut off a little bit of this. And I think it might be less in this way. And then we have one, two, three, four, five, six lines. So say I don't think my thingy will work. Kind of does.
that. So now I'm just going to write with my, first of all, I'm going to take that, this pen. I'm going to go around the edges. I'm not going to be careful. Just going to go around the edges like this. I think I need a different pen. I'm gonna use this one. It's a little more, what do you call it? More inky or bolder. These are my Precise V5. And I use those for my journal. Bullet journal. Take a moment to be proud of. Ugh, I messed it up. All right. I'm going to do this again. But I'm going to do it again because I messed it up. I probably should do... Uh, let me just use a piece of cardstock for this here. Silly. Okay, I'm going to do it again because... And this time, I think I'm going to do it a little differently. First of all, I'm not going to worry about the. I'm going to just do it. Take a moment.
I forgot something too. But you know what I forgot? I forgot his little hands. So we will uh, put his little hands in here. Um, and I think it's like right here. And then right here. Yeah. Also, where is that? Here, give me this. I just see there's more actual stuff on the side here. Use the stuff. You know, you want it to be more shadowy on the side, I think. There. And then as far as the this, where's my paper towel? Can I make a little white dot? Yeah, you can't really see it, but I do have a paint pen, which I may go and get. I think I might, but anyway. So I got the little hands. Now I'm gonna take my eraser, I'll find it. I'm gonna erase all of this and hope I don't smear it. I need my paint pan. You rat. Paint pan. These things, once you, it's hard to get them started. So, shake it. I think it's coming. There it comes. Then I need this to go here, and I'm gonna go ahead and I'm going to put this down. I'm gonna use our glitter glue, I think. Put this here. <laughs> oh, he's so cute. Like how cute he is. He's so cute. Hello, little bee. I think mine needs like little um dots on his antennas. Just the little bitty ones. 
because I think he's cute. <laughs> Okay. Anyway, that's journaling with me for today. Thanks for watching. And until next time, I'll see you later. Bye.